Hi, my name's Kelly. I am a CBT therapist and forensic psychologist. And today we're going to be talking about the vagus nerve. So what actually is the vagus nerve? So it's the longest cranial nerve in your body. And it comes from the Latin word vagus for wandering because it wanders all the way throughout your body. And it connects your brainstem to your whole body. And only mammals have this nerve, if you wanted a fact. And it is one of the, the cranial nerves that connect the brain to the body. And the vagus nerve is a major part of how our bodies and brains function. And without it, our bodies wouldn't actually be able to do basic tasks. And by stimulating it, we can receive some really powerful benefits. It can help the immune system and inflammation. It also has four main functions. So sensory, special sensory, motor, and parasympathetic. We're going to be tapping into the parasympathetic, as you may remember that, as that is linked to our rest and digest system. And it is our body's own superpower to counterbalance the fight or flight system. And it can trigger a relaxation response in our brain and in the rest of our body. So I'm going to teach you one basic skill when we are looking at activating or stimulating the vagus nerve. So you want to lie on your back if it's comfortable to do so. You want to interweave your fingers on both hands and place them behind your head, kind of like you're sunbathing. So you hold your arms there. And as you hold them behind your head, without turning to your head, you want to look to the right without turning your head, remember. So just your eyes go over to the right. And you want to stay there until you yawn. <laughs> you Or you've, um, you start to swallow. So it works quite easily for me, but it may not go that quickly for you. So sorry, so you have your eyes like this. You look to the right until you yawn or swallow. And then you come back to a neutral position so your eyes are looking forward. And then once you've done that, you can repeat it on the other side. So you can have your hands here, look, lay down. And obviously, as you can see when I'm doing it, it actually can work when you are sitting up. But if you do it lying down, so you're, you're resting and it's probably more comfortable. And the reason that you move your eyes and it has this response to your vagus nerve is there's a direct neurological connection between the eight muscles in your eyes and the muscles that, that move our eyeballs. So it's kind of linked to the vagus nerve in that way. So I hope you found that helpful. If you would like me to show you more exercises about how you can stimulate your vagus nerve, then please let me know in the comments. But as always, thank you for watching and please like and subscribe. Thank you.